Welcome to Decoding Studio once again. In this video, we are going to discuss about Slotty animation. So as you can see, uh, these are the animation uh, you can use inside your project and you can make your project really awesome. Slotty animation is nothing, it's just a pre-built and predefined animation that you can integrate or you can use inside your React Native mobile application with the help of a package. So we are going to discuss how we can install that package and how we can use those predefined animations inside your React Native project. So as usual, I'm going to use my Smurf Drill project from my previous videos. And uh, before moving forward, if you haven't subscribed to this channel, please hit the subscribe button. And let's get started. So first of all, uh, we need to open uh, Loti GitHub link. And here you can see we have some of those animation that we can use. We have another website where we can uh, get another predefined animation, Loti animation basically. Those we can use inside our React Native project with the help of Loti package, this one. So let's install this package. So if you're using Yarn, you can use Yarn. Otherwise, you can use NPM. So in this Smurf drill project, I'm using NPM. So I'm going to use it. We have one more package named as uh, Loti iOS. So this is only for iOS and it's not required for Android. It's done. And this NPM Loti iOS. Okay. So now we will install port. So for that NPX pod install ios and if you're not using npx then you can also use cd ios pod install okay so pod is also installed and uh, as you can see i have created a loti animation separate file and inside app.js i have give a reference of this so we can use animations on this screen only so now we need to open here pod install we have already done so now we need to in import loti Loti view from uh, Loti React Native that we have installed here, right? Uh, we need to use this Loti views. So here we need to provide source. So source is nothing. It's just a path of that our Loti animation JSON file. So from where we can get the JSON. So for that, we need to open this link lotifiles.com. So from here, you can see we can find, discover some animations as well. So let's say welcome animation so as you can see we have some welcome animation so i'm going to use this one so for that i just need to click here and you can download it from here so we have a different uh, files so we need loti json so it's downloaded so you just need to open this file and and just use this word. let's rename it to um, welcome json you need to keep this uh, file inside your project so let's create need new folder called as assets and here you can import or you can d simply drag and drop so you can see welcome to json is here so now we need to import this welcome.json inside the source so for that we need to add uh, a require and here we need to provide a path so let's say assets and welcome.json okay so we have uh, uh, installed dependency so we need to rerun it let's close the terminal and let's run react native run ios you can see this image is here but it's not animated so let's say um, auto play and refresh it. so welcome animation is here so we will try some uh, one more animation so let's go to this uh, lotifiles.com and you can see some other animation let's remove it 
happy. Mm -hmm. So we will use, uh, we will download this one from Lottie JSON and show it in Finder. It's downloading. Rename it happy and open this and here you can import it as well so now let's open it and copy then paste let's see it's working okay so basically we have two and let's give it a style margin top 50 okay so you can see now we need to replace this welcome with happy so let's say happy and refreshing it and you can see let's interchange both of them because it's overlapping over here we can give a height and width as well so height 100 width 100 something like this so showing over here so let's make it around 300 width and height is like around 200 so something like this mm, say 200 okay and let's use one more let, mm, success one so uh, this one download loti json and simply open shin finder rename success just simply re rename it to success and you can see it's showing success. This is all about Lodi animation that you can use inside your React Native project and you can make your app really awesome. So this is all about this video. Don't forget to hit the like button and thank you for watching. And if you haven't subscribed to this channel, please hit the subscribe button now.